Hey guys, Jason Guyman here. Just gonna show you a little training here on how to wire a push button on a hose reel, on electronic, or electronic, electric hose reels. Um, here is the button right here. We use um, the waterproof buttons for outdoors. They're as waterproof as they're gonna get. Um, but uh, basically, the uh, the button is covered with the boot and water is not supposed to get in there we usually don't have too much issues out of these they usually last about mm, year two years and that's out in the water and the rain and all the crud that hits them so it's not too bad um, we do use um, we do use um, weather heat shrinking terminals I just like it so that way it keeps the water out of it but uh, just show you here what we got here. Um, I'm not actually going to do this video on the actual um, the hose reel, but I do have a solenoid and a button, and um, so that way you'll kind of get the gist of what we're doing here. All right. So right here we have our. Um, our solenoid. This is the solenoids I've been using here lately. Um, they've been working very well. They come. This is what comes standard on the uh, on the Titans, and I've had really good luck with them. Um, I haven't put the ends on here, but I'm just gonna. Sh I'm using red and black as a, a just a thing. Um, this is actually going to be hot once that solenoid is on. But right now I want to show it kind of the dead side of this is your positive. This is coming from the battery, your switch, your hot source right here. So um, you'll have one side and then this side here will be going to your motor. Um, so that's to your motor. So basically how the switch works get by the wire here let's make sure I didn't mess it up here is one wire on here goes to the hot so this will get a, a bigger terminal on it and one goes to the to the um, the switch side of this thing you don't have to use very big wire for this because what a relay does is take low power to turn it on and off high power and then you can take this in and it doesn't really matter which side this goes but these just go right there um, so this this black line is actually dead until you hit the switch so that's why you can take a little jumper wire sometimes and one way I test to see if this is one of the things that is bad you can take a jumper wire and uh, I'm gonna just do it this way so I'm not confusing people but the red and red, take that jumper wire and hit that and see if it works. If that works, it's probably your switch is bad. But uh, um, I got these switches off of Amazon, got the relay off of Amazon. Um, they're not that expensive at all. But uh, I just wanted to show you. So basically, you'll have one wire here goes to the, your um, hot, to your, to your battery power. The other one goes to there. And then the other two just go to the back of that, uh, of your switch. Hope that helped you out. I'm not trying to make this video too long. I, was, I had a question of how to wire them up. And so that's why I'm did this video for you but uh, if you have any questions please um, comment below and I'll get back to you as fast as I can um, also um, please subscribe to the channel hope you all have a great day and thanks bye